What's up everybody and welcome to another YouTube video. My name is Eddie and I am still addicted to Marvel Snap and today we are looking at an artist set of variants and we're going to pick our top five. If you guys are new here, uh, what we normally do is we check out variants of a specific character in Marvel Snap and we rank them from worst to best. But once a month, I like to take a variant set from an artist and look at our top five. Last month, we looked at Max Greek's variants and we picked our top five from there. But today, we are going to be picking somebody else. So let's go right over here. This is the snap.fan website as you guys can see here These are all the different sets of variants that you can find within the game So there's the usual pixel the chibis baby Dan hip uh, Last month like I said, we checked out max Greek. He has 35 of them. We picked our top five We've got peach momoko and this month I figured because two of his cards are in the season pass as variants, let's look at Ryan Gonzalez. So right over here, Ryan Gonzalez has 17 uh, variants in the game. 14 are for cards that are released, and three of them are unreleased. We're going to look at all 17 of them, talk about each one, and we're going to pick our top five favorites. So as always, if you're watching along, tell me which one is your favorite, your least favorite, your top five, however you want to do it, and comment who should be the next artist we look at next month? And what other Marvel Snap characters you want me to look at all their variants and rank from worst to best because that's our weekly videos. So let's jump right into it over here. So like I said here, this is the Snap.Fan website. These are Ryan Gonzalez variants. He has 14 of the characters that are in the game. Uh, I got to say instantly, I adore this style. Um, at first, when I first first saw this style, uh, I wasn't a huge fan of it, but the more I saw the characters and then when you see them all together, you really see the artist's touch there and I really like it. I like when a character's art really pops out and you can tell that is that that artist's style. And uh, Ryan, same as Dan Hip and Max and a couple, obviously most of them, their styles really match, uh, like stand out for such like such a good style such a cool style is what i'm trying to say sorry i'm distracted because i'm looking at these i'm already trying to think what are my favorites so let's look over here we got arrow we got chavez we got cosmo we got crystal unfortunately crystal's card uh the card itself sucks but that's such a really cool um variant the way i'm gonna pick these it doesn't i'm gonna change my rules for today it doesn't matter what i think of the card itself so I've, even though i'm not a fan of crystal as a card that's not how we're going to pick. I just want to pick my top five favorite art of the cards uh, over here. Polaris, awesome card over here. Jubilee, really like that one. Goose is one of the ones in the season pass. So is Cosmo. So if you guys purchase this month's season pass and you complete le up to level 50, you will get Cosmo and Goose by the end of the month. This Gambit here is so cool. I, I can already tell you guys it's probably going to be my top five. This Rogue is awesome. I don't... I feel like I have some of these in the game. Oh my god, this Valkyrie is so cool. Uh, Squirrel Girl, adorable. You love to see it. I uh, don't see the price. Okay, so some of them have their prices. So you can see here, Spectrum is twelve hundred gold. Uh, Shang Chi, man, that's a that's a really good Shang Chi there. So these are all the ones that are in the game already. We have three more unreleased cards. So if you don't want spoilers, uh, maybe don't look right now. But we're gonna look at three cards that are not in the game yet. So let's go right over here. Miss Marvel, Silk. And Silver Sable. Now, I'm very excited about what these characters do in the game. I will tell you right now, um, not a huge fan of the Silver Sable, Silver Sable here. But I think it's because I really like this art style's colors. It pops a lot of colors. And this one obviously doesn't have a lot of color compared to like Miss Marvel here. Looks awesome. Very, very cool. So, let's go over here. Um, I got to pick five, right? So, we got to pick five. I think the two that instantly stand out to me are Gambit and Shang-Chi. Uh, so I'm gonna pick those two. Valkyrie, oh my God, that's a really good one. So I have four right now. Uh, I've got Miss Marvel. I've got Gambit, Shang Chi, Valkyrie. I want to see if any of these other ones. Oh, they're so good. Um, that Spider Woman is really cool. I'm debating Spider Woman or Squirrel Girl right now, and I do like Arrow a lot too and Chavez. But no, I think I'm leaning more towards Spider Woman and Squirrel Girl. Ooh, that's a tough one. I think I want to go Spider-Woman just because there's more color to it. And also, there's a lot more, like, little characters to them, which I kind of like that they have these added characters onto it as well. So I think those are my five right now. We got Miss Marvel. We got Gambit. We got Shang-Chi. We got Valkyrie. And we got Spider-Woman. Now I got to pick my top five in... I have to rank them. That's the hardest part. So while I decide where I want to rank them, make sure to comment down below which one are your favorites. Uh, make sure to give this video a uh, thumbs up as well. And subscribe while you're at it if you like talking variants of Marvel Snap. Alrighty, alrighty. I think I'm going to go this one here. I think I want to do that one there. Yeah, alright, there we go. 
I've picked I've picked my top five. Okay. You guys ready? My number five is the Spider Woman. Um, I think it's kind of obvious that I would pick this one as my number five, considering that was the last one I had to pick there. So between her and Squirrel Girl, those are like my top six five right there. Love this one. Such a good card. Love the little characters that are out of here, like the Hulk, uh, Spider Gwen. I think that's Captain Marvel, Spider-Man at the bottom here, and Black, uh, Black Cat right over here. Very cool card. Uh, love the colors. I love that the spider web in the back just has like a like color change as it goes through. Very, very cool. Love this one. My number four is Gambit. I like Gambit a lot as a card in the game too, so that helps. But I just think he looks really cool with the card on fire over here. Such a good card. Again, the colors really pop out with the style. Love it. Number three is Miss Marvel. Um, I really like this card a lot. I think that I, I'm a little biased towards the fact that I don't see much of her. Like, uh, let me see here. Oh, that's those. She has a pretty good one. Man, I can't wait for her to be in the game. This is going to be such a fun card to have. But really like this one. I like that there's a little bit of like a pixel plane here. Like, it looks like it's like a mix of different things. Like, the cloud here is pixelated as well. Love that. I think it's a little nice touch to have like two different styles within one card. So that's a really cool thing. My number two is Shang-Chi. Once again, has a bunch of little characters here. I don't know who these characters are, so if you guys know a lot of lore, lore for Shang-Chi, please tell me who these uh, one, two, three, four characters are, because I don't know who they are. Such a cool card. I love Shang-Chi. And I got to be honest, I don't think Shang-Chi has a lot of good variants. I mean, he has one that I like a lot, but this is pretty cool as well. Like, I, I think this is probably one of my favorite of the Shang-Chi overall when you compare it to all of the other ones. Very cool. Love the pose that he has there. The The background's a little bland, but I think that there's already so much happening with, like, the clouds, the character, and all that, that the bland background is not a big deal here. And I, I surprisingly to me, my number one is Valkyrie. Such a cool card. I talk about this all the time that I love when you take a character like Valkyrie or any other characters and you drastically change what they look like. And in this case, as you guys can see instantly, Valkyrie is very different from her base card and from all her other variants actually as well. Um, very, very cool here. Love that one. Love the rainbow in the background. Lots going on. But the colors really pop and Valkyrie looks badass. And that is my number one. Ryan Gonzalez, thank you so much for these awesome awesome variants i hope you keep adding them if you're watching this i mean i don't know why i'm talking to you you might not watch this but if you do awesome variants i love your stuff please keep adding them to the game and i can't wait to see more of them as always chat uh chat i'm not live on twitch comment if you enjoy this what is your favorite what character should i do next what artist should i look at next give this video a thumbs up subscribe do all that fun stuff that helps the youtube algorithm gods to give this video more attention and have a good rest of your day. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.